Hola y bienvenidos. Today we're exploring Plaza de Toros de las Ventas, the largest bullring in Spain. So we've just passed through the entrance now. It costs 16 euros to get in, and when you come in, they'll give you a device like this, and this allows you to have an audio guided tour in your designated language. So the arena is named after the location it was built in with the Las Ventas, literally meaning in English, sales. Now, the arena has a capacity of just under 24,000 seats and it actually started its build in 1922 but didn't finish until 1929. And then two years later, in 1931, it was inaugurated. So this wasn't the first ball ring in Madrid. The previous ball ring, Plaza de Toros de la Fuente del Berro, was actually built before this, and then by the time the 20th century came along, it was looking a bit worse for wear, so they decided to build Las Ventas. So seating can be split into three key areas. You've got the sunny seats, the shaded seats, and then the sunny and shaded seats. This is important because it traditionally influenced things like your social class because shaded seats are more sought after and are therefore more expensive. So what happens if there's no scheduled bullfighting at Las Ventas? Well, basically um, the ring or the arena can be used for other events such as music concerts, sports events, and even theatre shows. Now. As animal rights activism has increased over the years, the number of actual bullfights has reduced. So Las Ventas seems to be entertaining more and more outside events. So behind me you can see uh, the gift shop. There's also a museum at the end, uh, which is included in the tour. Um, there's a lot of notice boards and artifacts here as well. Um, so if you're interested in coming here, um, Something I found out last night whilst researching is that Las Ventas, the official website, has a virtual tour. Um, so if you're interested and you want to do some um, preparation, I highly recommend that you look that up. Thank you so much for watching, feel free to support me, keep on learning and I'll see you on the next one.